It's a common misconception that if you want the go anywhere ability of a Land Rover with a well built interior that you've got to pay through the nose. But the Fiat Panda Cross proves that you can have a capable 4x4 with a stylish interior and a bit of Italian flair, all wrapped up in a package that costs less than £17,000. On the face of it, it has all the quirkiness and charm of the 500, with lots of the styling carried over like the squircle design cues dotted all over. But thanks to the 161mm of ground clearance and some beefed up off-road protective cladding, it really does look the part. So there isn't much choice when it comes to powertrains, there's only two available, a 0.9 litre two-cylinder petrol or a 1.3 litre diesel, both of which are turbocharged. Those low capacity engines mean that running costs aren't exactly what you'd expect for a 4x4. The petrol returns nearly 58 miles per gallon, while the diesel offers just over 60 miles per gallon. I think the term characterful motoring really was devised for the Panda Cross. It's an absolute hoot to drive. While it may not be the most powerful of 4x4s, it really feels solid, and you really get the sense that it can tackle any kind of terrain. Around town, its excellent visibility and small size means that it can nip through traffic and parking is an absolute piece of cake, especially with the city button that lightens the steering. Inside, the squircle theme continues, whether it's on the steering wheel, the dials, the heater controls, radio, or even the gear lever. It's all very neatly laid out, and although the soft touch plastics aren't exactly soft touch, they should prove pretty durable. The seating position is excellent, as too is the pedal alignment. It's just a shame that the steering wheel only moves up and down rather than in and out. And as we've already mentioned, all round visibility is fantastic. What might seem surprising for a car with such small dimensions is the excellent use of space. There's lots of head and leg room, not only for the driver, but for the passengers too. The boot offers 225 litres of space, and thanks to the split folding 60-40 seats, this can be extended further. Further. Plus it has a low lip which means you can load heavy items without putting your back out. It's good in all conditions and simply great fun. We'd be more inclined to opt for the diesel if it was our choice. The running costs are better, the engine is smoother and the service intervals are longer. 25,000 miles compared to 18,500 miles in the Twin Air. Overall, the Panda Cross is a really likeable baby 4x4. Okay, so for many, the standard Panda will be more than enough, but for a select few who want something that's gonna live in urban areas during the week and then tackle the rough stuff at the weekends, there is really very little that comes close.